Enjoy watching. Puberty hits everyone hard. I look forward to experiencing it myself one day. But some animals undergo physical changes that are truly incredible. Unfortunately, getting older isn't the only reason for these. Get the tissues out. This one's gonna be a real tearjerker. From an orangutan that was abandoned as a baby to whatever this tiny pink blob is, let's meet some animals that went through truly amazing transformations. Ghastly goats. There's nothing quite like a cute little baby animal. This is a Damascus goat. Ah, look at this little face. Damascus goats are native to the Middle East and known for their long, flowing ears. They look kinda mystical, he wouldn't be out of place wandering around Skyrim. However, this adorable visage doesn't last. Prepare yourself for an adult Damascus goat. Arg, What happened? Well, believe it or not, there are folks out there that think Damascus goats only get cuter as they age, so they're selectively bred to accentuate their weird features as much as possible. In some cases, owners even remove their ears. Poor things. Back in 2008, there was a goat festival in Saudi Arabia where these guys were judged to find the most beautiful. After the winners were chosen, they were sold at auction. Can you guess how much the most expensive one went for? $67,000. Are you kidding me? If you ask me, these things look like regular goats that have been left in the sun too long, I certainly wouldn't pay such an eye-watering amount for one. Especially when some of the practices around their breeding are so questionable. What do you think? Are these goats cute or hideous? Let me know in the comments. Hefty hooves. As I was always told by daddy, having a pony is a lot of responsibility, you couldn't even look after a goldfish little. I never got my pony. In hindsight, it was probably for the best. Horses need a lot of attention, including having their hooves trimmed every few weeks. Kind of like our fingernails. If they don't, well, you'll see. In 2017, a Shetland pony named Polly was found over in Belgium living in abject squalor, covered in lice and with her hooves wildly overgrown into painful spirals. It turns out, they hadn't been trimmed for 10 years. In a terrible case of neglect, her owner had kept her hidden away from public view in a makeshift shack far from any roads. The owner was nowhere to be seen when Polly was found, but it seemed the poor pony had been completely abandoned. Amazingly, though, Polly held on, and as soon as she was discovered, she got some much-deserved TLC, with her hooves finally being cut down and tended to. They're much better. Sadly, neglected horses aren't as uncommon as they should be. In Maryland, in 2015, a horse called Quest was rescued from a private farm after an eye-watering 15 years of neglect. Unbelievably, his hooves were in an even worse state than Polly's, at three feet long. Thankfully, though, he also received the care that he needed. Quest's hooves are now a nice, normal length. He's much happier. You know, seeing these wonderful grooming results has really inspired me. I'm finally going to trim my fingernails. What do you think about it? Write your comment. That's enough animal transformations for one day. I'm running out of tissues. Which of these did you think was the most amazing? Let me know down in those comments, and I'll see you the next one. Enjoy watching. They say you should be careful what you wish for because you just might get it. Well, today's video is all about people whose requests were granted, but resulted in some surprising and regrettable consequences. From high-piled pepperoni pizzas and cheesy beasts, to times people followed instructions precisely in the most facebomb-worthy ways. Join me as we witness people getting served literally what they requested. We all love pizza. In fact, according to a 2019 survey, it's the world's most popular dish. And for good reason. However, great pizza is the sum of its parts, and one's choice of topping can be make of break. And for anyone who suffers from heliophobia, the fear of olives, you might want to look away. When a customer requested, in their own words, a very generous amount of olives, one cook decided to put his olives where his mouth was and served up this. Unbelievably, the customer was said to be very pleased, but if you ask me this olive overload is truly a nightmare. And I'm afraid the nightmare only continues. Another olive fiend stopped by a pizza truck and was asked whether he wanted, quote, little olives or a lot of olives, to which he evidently chose the latter judging by this photo. God forbid that was actually the smaller serving, 
meaning the larger one might have looked something like this. Of all the pizza toppings, pepperoni certainly reigns supreme. And don't take it from me, ask the 64% of Americans who prefer its sumptuous, smoky flavor to any other topping. But as the saying goes, too much of a good thing can become bad. That sentiment was seemingly lost on one guy who didn't just request extra pepperoni, as he so eloquently put it. An ungodly amount of pepperoni, and well, that's certainly what he got when he received this cholesterol-popping pizza. Looks pretty ungodly to me. On that note, if you are in the market for something to clog your arteries, then Grant's Pizza House in Michigan has you covered. Behold the Dragon Scale Pizza. This beast is so tightly packed with pepperoni that they have to be neatly staked into a scaly pattern, which you can imagine is quite the grease feast. Interestingly, according to one Redditor, this fierce menu item was the result of many customers regularly requesting as much pepperoni as possible. Well, they asked and Grant's Pizza House certainly listened. Better yet, popular pizza chain Little Caesars have even gotten on the salami surge, with what they call the Old World Fanceroni Pepperoni Pizza, featuring at least 100 pepperonis topped on top of one another. They'd be wise to sell this pizza with a side of health insurance and a waiver, if you ask me. Reckon you could defeat any of these pizzas? Hey, let me know down in the comments. While it's hard to believe, not everyone wants their pizza topped with a meat sweat inducing heap of pepperonis. This next guy simply wanted a half pepperoni, half cheese pizza. However, what he actually asked for was a pepperoni pizza that's half cheese, which, admittedly, is quite an ambiguous way to put it. The result was, much to his surprise, literally what he asked for, a pepperoni pizza, with cheese only on one half. If you listen carefully, you'll hear the cries of cheese friends far and wide. After all, a 2017 study found that the average American consumes 37 pounds of cheese a year. That's roughly the weight of around 12 chihuahuas. In fact, one cheesy fella had such a hankering for the stuff that he requested six times the usual amount of cheese on his burger. The result, however, was much less a cheese dream than it was a gross mound of slop that melted in the heat of its container. Word of advice, if the cheese doesn't fit on the burger, then I think it's a sign you may have gone a little overboard. That said, it seems there's a market for these hot cheesy messes. They call them volcano burgers. The idea being that you simply drench the entire thing in melted cheese. And why stop there? You might as well go ahead and lather yourself in it while you're at it. And that, folks, is all for today. Have you ever had any painfully literal request results like these? Let me know down in the comments and be sure to like and subscribe. What do you think about it? Write your comment. Catch you in the next one.